Hi there friends, I'm just reading from a very interesting article, I'll leave the link below the video, it's from Breaking Israel News. Now I'll read part of the article and you can click and read the rest of it at your leisure. But the title is the thing that actually caught me. It says, thanks to Trump, the Paschal Lamb, that is the Passover Lamb, could be sacrificed on the Temple Mount for the first time in 2,000 years. The article says, As per Trump's deal of the century, the Sanhedrin petitioned the Israeli government filing to receive permits that would allow priests to perform the ritual of the Passover sacrifice on the temporary altar that will be transported to the Temple Mount and removed immediately after the ceremony. Now, if the government grants the permits, as it should based on Israeli and international law, this will be the first time since the destruction of the Temple Mount that an altar has stood in its proper place on Judaism's holiest site, the threshing floor, purchased by King David. For the past eight years, the Sanhedrin has been conducting reenactments of the temple service as a means of preparing for the actual reinstating of the service. These reenactments are held before each of the biblically mandated feasts by Kohanim, that is, Jewish men descended from Aaron, the high priest, dressed in the proper temple garb. So that's really interesting. And as you see from the pictures above, you'll see that the instruments have all been made ready for going into the temple. The priests are in training constantly. They're practicing the sacrificial system, ready for the uh, commencement of the sacrificial system when the temple is built. Just four years ago, they elected the first high priest of the temple in 2000 years now all of this is i keep saying this whenever i make a video about israel this is unprecedented in history this has never happened before but it's happening now today in these end times to have this happen the scattered people of israel would have to be regathered back into israel they are back in israel they would have to have, be controlling Jerusalem. They do control Jerusalem. They don't control the Temple Mount, but they are asking for the Waqf, that is the Jordanian overseers, to be removed from the Temple Mount so that it is back in Israel's hands. All of this is, as I say, unprecedented. Now we know the temple will be built, we know the sacrificial system will be recommenced, we know everything is ready to go whenever they say go, they'll go and do it, but we also know that this will herald the outbreak of the final seven years great tribulation and the rise, the appearance of the man the Bible calls the son of perdition, the Antichrist. I pray that you are ready to meet Jesus Christ when he returns to destroy the Antichrist and rescue the church from these coming days. Thanks for watching. I'll speak to you soon. Don't forget to give a like if you like the video and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't subscribed already and ring the bell so that you are notified when news items like this pop up. Thanks again. I'll speak to you soon. God bless. Bye-bye.